We got ourselves a brand new anime season going in summer 2024. And the first one we're going to check out is uh, something about a guy being in the Deeming Lord's army while trying to make peace with the human side. Let's begin today's reaction. Some kind of library? Ike. Not Ike? Holy shit, it's Hiroki Sawano. No, sh wait, wait, wait. Who did the soundtrack for this? I know these beats. I know these instruments. This is Hiroki Sawano, right? Is he about to just hard clutch in another shitty show? I don't know if this show is shitty, but you know, Hiroki Sawano has a fantastic resume of just like, you know, just, just clutching every anime with the soundtrack. Listen, listen, listen. Wasn't that him? Maybe I'm crazy. The goblins are attacking! It's Kota Yamamoto. It's a part... So the composer is not Hiroyuki Sawano, but it's Kota Yamamoto, who is an apprentice of Sawano. Ah, oh, that's why it sounds so similar. They did Attack on Titan together? Goddamn, thank God. We need more people to learn from him, so we can just have, like, every composer... No, that'd be a bad idea. Every composer sounding the same would be a bad idea. It's Shiki and Emma, guys. Shiki and Emma from Fiskimichi. Don't be so sad that it's over, guys. <gasps> I think this is CGI. Holy shit, we're just clobbering people. It's him! The guy from Overlord, guys! <laughs> guys, stop asking for Overlord reactions. This is the closest you're gonna get to Overlord reactions from me. We're not doing Overlord until Season 5 is announced. And think to yourself, why would I farm Overlord right now? We're gonna wait like a year or two. When Season 5 gets announced, our channel's gonna be nearing 100k subs. I'm gonna get so much more out of Overlord if I start later than then right now. Why would I start Overlord right now? Think! Think from my perspective, okay? 7th Corp. Undying. Okay. That's pretty honorable, yeah? I, I like three. I like three. Okay, what the fuck was that? What was that incantation? Was that speed casting or was that a random language? So listen, listen carefully again. He's like, <laughs> Probably a non lethal skill, right? Damn. What a good guy. It's the MILF wizard! Exceeding expectations? Is she our manager? What is this? <laughs> this is such an insane thing to see, bro. You see these... You see these dudes? Like, we were beating their asses with their bare fists, just clobbering them at the end. Now we're just, like, carrying them out on stretches and tending to their wounds. What an insane, you know, turn of events, because, like... Usually, you know, if you're siding with the orcs or goblins or them, we're out to just kill these humans, right? But it's like... We're saving because this show is about like making peace with them, right? This show is about we're not really the bad people here. We can coexist. No way! Oh! Plot twist. Oh! Would have been a crazy plot twist. Because we are, because the trailer and the opening kind of shows you it. I doubt that it, like, I think I'm fine with getting spoiled for little details like this by checking out the trailer and getting hyped up from the opening, right? I think it's not a big deal. We're a grandson of this guy, right? Not blood related, though. Why is man grandchild? I think we even have a stamp. 
滅びた文明のことは誰にそしてもう一ついついかなる時もその仮面とローブを脱いではならんぞ、うん、お前の勝負 Really?、はい We even have fake horns. So cute. No. Oh, never mind. Oh! We need to kill her. We need to kill her. We have an airhead maid. Which is very cute. Cunny moment. Wow, we don't have memory erasing magic? The new demon lord. It must be the girl that looks like Aura from Freedom, right? The shorter girl, right? So the new demon lord isn't like the other last one, only cares about results. Doesn't the new one is like pretty reasonable? So smart! We can make money off of them! <laughs> Capitalism, let's go! That's a crazy voice acting right there. He actually sounded like a pig while he bumped into it. Did you hear that? You, you heard this from the stage? <laughs> 95% of your earnings! Nah, it's gonna be a very reasonable tax, right? Okay. Wow, so nice! Yes, sir! Ooh, we just got summoned. The fuck? It's too dark, I can't see anything. There's a big boy there, though. Not again? Why would this happen again? The commander just summons him and puts him through his test every time. It's the mill sorcerer! And you know what? I do agree. I think this is to hide the bad CGI. There's a moment in the beginning where things are really dark, it was, especially with the ogres, with the orcs, and they're like killing people. But like, I could kind of see that it was CGI, but it was so dark that it was kind of hard to know unless you're really focused. So even now, I think they're just like fucking. Saving budget, you know, so like what happens in the blu-ray releases, right? Because in the blu-ray DVD releases one of the um, Biggest uh, incentive to buy is they make the anime release really dark and you can't really see stuff or censorship And then the blu-ray DVD shows everything right, but then if you show more here Then you're gonna show the shitty CGI. So it's like, you know, you just get fucked up there, too so strong! If I only I could see who he's killing! What's going on, mother? Mm. Anything else you make? She knows her secret. She's like our manager, basically. Is is she okay with how... Okay, she is fine with it. Uh, that's a... Dairokuten is a name that I've heard before in other isekais recently and refers to the Demon Lord, right? Why is it Dairokuten sama now? Because like, usually it's just always Mao, and Ma is like demon, O is king, which is synonymous to lord or, you know, demon king, demon lord. But Dairokuten is a term I'm seeing for, you know, Demon Lord recently as well. Okay. Let's go get rewarded by the lolly. At least I think the Mao looks like a lolly. Of course the author knew! Of course! The author knew we would say that. <laughs> I would never touch the cheat cheese. Listen, I'd be like, oh, it's so dark. I, 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 it's so dark. Where is this your shoulders? Okay, I, th I think I got to your shoulders. Whoops! Oh no, it was so dark. You blame me? What's up with this girl, man? Is she gonna be important? 
She's stuck here because of the barrier. It's not gonna go away. She's just stuck forever. Oh shit. There's a lot of hard boiled eggs? What is that? Here's some food. Eat this and stay put. Bro made like 20 hard boiled eggs and said just stay here, bro. She's very cunning though, huh? What is it? Is that made? Very cute. I love her. She's kind of a dumb airhead cunny. And here we go. Classic Mao castle on top of a fucking cliff. Purple dark clouds. Give me a lightning strike. Yeah, yeah, there it is. There it is. There it is. Yeah. <laughs> oh, to make him look like more demonic, I guess. Our grandfather's goaded. So big for no reason. Yeah. The fuck, I gotta walk for like 40 minutes. Get so long in here. We can't learn it? Teach us how to use it. Better. Oh, that's not even. No, no, no. I thought it was that the, the, the twin tail lolly fucking the aura from Freedom looking girl. Okay, the current demon lord. Dairokuten. Turn around the war against humanity. Lore. The strongest man. Meritocracy overall. Great. But he united everybody. I think it's still gonna be the lolly, right? We're gonna bait it, right? Let's see the strongest man ever in the demon side. That intermission scene soundtrack was fucking holy. <laughs> Aura from Fiden. There it is in the trailer. You fucking dated me. It's not the strongest man, unless this is a man. Noni. The strongest girl. So humble. She knows. She knows maybe. Are you good with that? Don't make money off of them. I bet she's cool with it. Yeah. We, we made more money off of people if they, you know, we don't kill all of them. That she's a lolly? No, she's not. They keep mentioning this ancient civilization, and the grandfather Romberg told us in the past that we shouldn't ask questions about it, right? It's the one thing that we should never talk about or bring forth light to. The ancient, civil the ancient civilization is probably once a society of like when demon kind and mankind used to coexist in peace, and it was so great of you know different innovations and you know it's it's like. So much better. And then some shitty thing probably happened with the previous demon lord, you know, the one that only fucking cared about results. I, I forget. There's a shitty demon lord before, and this is a new demon lord, right? So I'm just gonna guess ancient civilization used to be coexistence of all, you know, demons and mankind, and then new demon lord got all fucking racist and fucking, you know, set them apart, and now we're trying to get back to that, you know, ancient civilization time when everything was great. That's my guess about this show. Can we, can we show her? Would she be fine? Yes, ma'am! <laughs> Why is she 
Well, yeah, if you're that close, you can see the human eyes, bro. Like, she has to know, right? Maybe she already does and she doesn't mind. Who knows? Punishment. What about the maid? Where is she? Where's the maid? She ate it all. <laughs> this girl is... <laughs> She's very cute and funny, right? She she is just peak cunny right now. <laughs> Get up, motherfucker! <laughs> chill, chill. <laughs> Your name is thirteen. <laughs> you better not be thirteen. What the fuck kind of name is thirteen? <laughs> Slaves are given numbers. <laughs> Sati, got it. <gasps> I don't actually expect her to keep the secret because she seems to be an airhead, right? She's gonna leak the secret so fast. I don't know. I don't really trust her to be very secretive. Oh, she's so happy. I was gonna say Isekai, but this isn't Isekai. This is a native Isekai show, right? All the elements of an isekai anime is present without the main character who's an otherworlder. But still, it's in a native isekai map. It's a, it's a pretty unique map where it's like backed up by the mountainside, huh? It's not just a circle with moats of water around it. That's nice. We have a different size map for once. Shit looks like Attack on Titan map, actually. These houses now, I look at it. Alright. Okay. We haven't met the human side yet. <laughs> you can't just tax them. Oh shit. Our manager. I want to see her in action. No, you're too good for that. One month? More CGI ogres. Orcs, let's go. CGI's got, they ain't even fucking moving. They, they ain't even fucking moving. It's a CGI PowerPoint presentation. They better be saving the budget for something real nice, man. Overall, the use of CGI in this show has been pretty smooth, right? Like, like there has been moments where the CGI was so jarring. They're pretty skillful at mas- It's not really masterful. They're just making shit look dark sometimes. But like, sometimes the CGI also doesn't move, which like makes it less jarring. So just like interesting techniques that they're doing to kind of like mask the bullshit, right? Yeah, coexistence, wow. Great. He's even paying. They got salaries, guys. Guys, everyone's got fair eight hour shifts. They even get a salary for this. This is great. Okay. <gasps> Magic time. Damn. <laughs> Piggy realizes Ike is a golden goose. Huh, so the intro scene of the girl in the library, right? The intro scene, this is 22 minutes at, at the moment, right? The intro scene, the girl, is that her maid? This is, no, if you look at her hairstyle, it is the maid. It is the maid. It's the, if you look at her hair bangs, it's the same hairstyle. And she's reading a book, and the book is telling us the stories of today's episode. As if these are events of the past and Ike already is the demon lord and now she's just kind of making sure that... Like, like right now in her present timeline in the intro, Ike probably is a demon lord and this is basically a history, like an autobiography of him and she's just kind of relishing the moments because she loves it so much. I'm not really sure, but the hair looks familiar. Either it is the maid or it's very similar, right? Right, here's the book of them, Ike. And then here's the maid again, which I'm assuming is the maid or someone related. And that is, you know, this new anime we're watching. What do you guys think? So far, first episode, while it does have an interesting premise, I guess, because the main character is a human, you know, that's, you know, catfishing the demon side and trying to bring peace. 
it hasn't been enticing enough to be such a hook, right? And I think we need to wait. I think that, you know, once we get to see the human side and the conflict, you know, um, escalates, maybe it'll get more interesting. So far, this episode was a very slow start of just kind of establishing what Ike is, you know, teasing about the ancient civilization, which probably is the coexistence with humans and demons a long time ago. Introducing other characters, the demon lord, what she's like, our cunning maid, our milf manager. And besides that, I'm just kind of waiting for the show to kind of like pop off. So depending, again, at the end of the day, these weekly seasonal animes is, is all dependent on you guys. If you're gonna, you know, watch the videos and the videos can perform at the same level as the community series, we keep them. If they don't, we drop them. It's that simple. If you're still here, if you didn't enjoy this reaction, please like the video, check out the other playlist for more content, and until next time, take care.